Well, a good Monday morning, everybody. A lot of folks do have a, a long weekend. And boy, we couldn't ask for better weather for this uh, Columbus Day holiday. And this weekend was just absolutely spectacular. I think folks are still just just giddy about uh, the beautiful weather we had. We're starting off with uh, some clouds hanging around here this morning, and we are going to see more clouds increasing throughout the day. There are plenty of them down there to the south. A lot of moisture is coming in here from the Pacific Ocean and that storm off there, which is going to be making landfall and working its way across northern Mexico in our direction. So here's the uh, computer model, and we'll have sort of a mixture of sunshine and clouds, like I said today, but then clouds thicken up tonight and tomorrow during the day. We are going to see some showers developing the better opportunity, better place to see rain is going to be down to the south and to the southeast as that goes across the area. That storm works its way across the area, and that's going to be the situation through most of the day tomorrow into the early morning hours of Wednesday. Now, as far as today, 83, we are still going to be just below normal. We are upper 70s over the weekend. Then we go into the next seven days. Now, tomorrow we've got the chance for some rain later in the day, overnight into early Wednesday. Then things are going to start to heat up. We're going to be knocking at the door of 90 by Thursday. Humidity is going to be around as well. However, just in time for the weekend, another front moves through early on Friday. That is going to clear us out, get rid of the humidity. Another fantastic weekend in store just in time for the eclipse late Saturday morning. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.